Hello everyone, I am PurpleLink33, welcome back to another edition of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Last time, I do not want to talk to you, last time we took care of the stuff over here, got 50 more Korok Seeds, leaving us with just 50. That'll happen next episode, that'll be the end of the Koroks. The end is near. This time, we're going to head down to this pedestal one final time. And we're not going to leave it to Maka. We're going to take care of this all ourselves. Alright. Once again. Two things you want to do. Cook some stuff up. I've got several attack power-up things. Because I used whatever dragon parts I had left. I'm going to eat that. You want two full stamina wheels. You want your full 30 hearts. Or two full extra stamina wheels, I should say. And you want to save the ever-loving shit out of this. The farthest I have been on this next segment is floor 17. There is a lino on that floor. I tried to fight it by itself. I tried to fight it, you know, like normal type. Uh, you're supposed to take it out with an ancient arrow. There's two lino's in this particular segment. There are 23 floors. What sucks is floor 18 was a safe floor that had three hardy bass in it. Um, if there were more, if you have fewer than two fairies, it'll give you a fairy or, or two, um, and some uh, royal uh, stuff. There's some elemental hazards here that's gonna that's gonna really hurt us. We have we start with uh, thunderstorm, then we go to a fire area, then an icy area, and then I believe it is, uh, it's like it's just like a, it's like fair and woods. At any rate. 23 Floors of Hell. Here we go. Now given a third option, there's the beginning trials, the middle trials, and what I'm reluctantly doing, the final trials. This may be a very short video, I say every time I do this. I may only give this one try. Because I, not gonna lie, I'm not very confident in my skills as a player, but we are gonna find out if this is possible for me. Here we go. The final trials. This is the last time we're going to do the trial of the sword. I might freak out a little bit if I get all the way to the end. I might freak out just a little tiny bit if we make it all the way to the end. Here we are, one last time. To the Blade's chosen hero, in the name of the Goddess Hylia, I offer the Trial of the Sword. You are nearly worthy of wielding the true splendor of the Master's Sword. Yeah? You must fortify your mind, body, and soul by eradicating all obstacles that appear in this realm. In this illusory realm of sacred mystery, anything can happen, including thunderstorms. All that you obtain here will be lost upon your return to the reality you know, but you might actually die. Chosen hero of the Master Sword, overcome the trial of the sword, and claim the blade's true splendor. All right. I don't care if it broke. I'd call that a good start. Now. Oh god. That's gonna go boom. Okay, I'm getting out of here. We're gonna leave the, uh... We're gonna leave the arm behind. Hmm. 
Now, floor number two, five enemies here. Two electric keys and some stealth goblins. You can keep them at a, at a good distance here. Don't need to waste any of your arrows. Shit. Shit. That's three hearts every time. They're all gone. We are in trouble. A treasure chest over here. This will give us a Royal Guard sword. I'd call that important. Okay, got that done. We are down to 20 hearts. And we're moving on out of floor number three. Floor number three has two large electric choo choos and five stout moblins. get up here and they arise. Matters not, because I do want to get this. I want to get all the stuff. We have a night shield. Do it. Nope, there's another moblin right that just woke right behind me. That'll do it. That'll do it. Oh, thank you. I blew myself up. Because I'm smart. Wow. Uh, 18 and a quarter with no implements to save myself at this point. Floor number four, eight mounted style goblins.
Don't care. it yet? I think that's it. Okay, I got that. I got it. Nope. You will get nothing and like it. You're all dead? That should be everybody, right? That is everybody. Much better round. This room usually ends up kicking my ass, but I took zero damage. Why, yes, I am patting myself on the back a little bit. Pardon me for wanting to do so. I think we got everything here, so we are going to move on to floor number four. Five. This is five we're going to. Floor number five has us facing off with a Stalnox. That's what I want. Run like hell, run like hell, run like hell. Damn it, game. See you! Ping. Gone. No. Now you're gone. No. Now you're gone. And I want all three of these right now. Elemental weapons are going to be our godsend in the rest of, the, of these levels. And my Moblin Club is badly damaged. Of course it is, because why not? Anything back here? No. Is there anything up there? There is a treasure chest in this direction. It is buried. And it's about to get zapped. I want none of, I want no part of that. Ow. Five ice arrows. Very important. All right. 
Having gotten all of this, I think it's time we made our quick exit. Out we go. Thank you for playing in the rain, Sir Link. This is floor number six. It is a rest area. Two very important things here. Number one is going to be what's in, the, what's in those chests over here. Number two is going to be that fairy back there. Again, because it's a free revive. I have gone in here and made the fairy fly away. It is not a good thing. Okay, now that we've got all that done. I do not want the torch. Bye. Okay. That's gone. Give me your apples and your fishies. Armored carp. All right, let's see what's in these bad boys here. Flamebreaker boots. We are going to a hot area. Chest number two. We're going to find us a knight's bow. Excellent. And we are also going to find us three ancient arrows. I'm going to go on record and say this. This is not the last time you will see ancient arrows in this area. Or in this uh, place, in this segment. There are a lot of them. We also got a double axe. I will take that. What else do we have here? I am dropping you. Save you. Going to need that. Okay. Now for the absolute most important part of this area. <gasps> really? You cook these by themselves. A guaranteed full heal plus one red heart plus one yellow heart. So this gives you stuff to use. A uh, hold, two, three, and four. And why not? Cook. This will give us triple attack up plus three uh, for 350. We run out of our attack up later. Um, three, two, three, and one. And why not two? This will give us defense up twice. 13 heart refill plus 330 of double defense. And then one, two, three, four, and five. Speed up for three minutes plus six hearts of fill. That's not what I want. All right, before you move on, you want to equip your boots. You also want to get better weapons. Um, I'm going to save the Royal Guard Sword for later. I am going to use this. Do not use any wooden weapons. Wooden weapons in this area are a bad idea. Which is why I still have my shield on. I did see something shiny over here. Oh, that was a torch. And it's a tree trunk that I felled. All right, all this in, six floors down, 17 to go. Next target is floor number 12. It's our next rest area. But it's going to be after a very, very hot time. We have three items that we can find here. Or, th or three types of enemies we can find here. Igneo Peblets. Uh. 
Now. Traveler sword that is crap. Ugh. Soldier spear. You know there was another rusty weapon in here. There's another rusty claymore in here, but I really have no desire to keep it to have it. But yeah, you can actually get hurt by that stuff, so uh, just be careful. We got, we didn't get really good draws here. Traveler's Sword, Traveler's Claymore, those are crap. And thus will likely be the first to be dropped off. I am going to use this though. We're going to get us a boomerang here. And move on to floor number eight. Number eight. Three Fire Breath Lazalfos. This is not hard. I mean, really, it's not hard. When you have a frost thing... Yet another strength in Lizalfo bow, Lizal bow. In here we find a toasty Endura Shroom. And a toasty Silent Shroom. I'm just going to go ahead and eat those right away. Bye. Ding, ding, ding. Ooh, fire arrows. I like those. We'll need those later on. We'll have to go back to the to the front part uh, where we were before. So we got a couple fire arrows here. I'd say we're doing pretty good in this area. Partially because I think we... I think partially, part of it is because we have uh, the elemental weapons. Moving on now to floor number nine. We have a Medio Wizard, a Blue Moblin, and two Fire Breath Lizalfos. Three of these enemies are um, susceptible to ice. One of them is not. Well, I mean, it is, but not quite like it should be. We're going to stay to the outside. Gone. just in time. I was going to get hit there. That was going to hurt. It was going to suck. Keep all this here. You want any and all of this. Double axe can be our workhorse of getting this stuff gone. The iron sledgehammer will be helpful. Getting more and more of these healing items that can just heal part of our health. We want to save these until we absolutely need them. Um, I don't think there's anything else in here. No treasure chest. The, the sensor's not going off. And did we, did we get the Meteo? I did. I did get the Meteo Rod. The Meteo Rod. That's good. We're gonna draw. Next bit, full 10. Fire Breath, Lizalfos, and three Black Malblins. Oh, that's a hell of a shot.
I will gladly take that. A strengthened Lizal bow. It's all at 25. That's actually really good. Okay, good. Give me that. Okay. We lost a Royal Claymore there. Or not a Royal... A, a, a Knight's Claymore. That's uh, 38 attack weapons, so... That's bad. Man, this is going to be a quiet episode, I think. Is the treasure chest up or is it down? Roast lotus seeds, good. A couple arrows, that's good. I'm gonna go ahead and call this an easily missed treasure chest. It's also one I wouldn't be able to open. That will give you three more ancient arrows. What do you want to do here? First and foremost, stay to the outside. Chuck and boom. That will give us some, uh, will give us some lift power. It is up we go. Yeah, let's go this way out. Oh shit. Ow. Not nice game. That hurt. That's fine. Give me some time to recoup. And I'm trying to not use. Oh, I'm tempted to use it. No, I want an additional 350 is what I want. Boom. 
Thank you, game. We're done. Whew. That is 12. That is 11. Nothing else here except the GTFO. That's what we need to do is just GTFO. Floor 12 will give you two fairies here. That is not what I wanted. I want those fairies. I want both of them. I need both of them. I would like to at least try to fight the Lionel on floor 17. Try to fight it legit. Now, this attack up, it's actually not going to matter. Because we are about to not have it anymore. Actually, what I might... Ooh, I have an idea. I have an idea, and it's going to work. First treasure chest we're going to find here, a Hylian tunic. Go ahead and equip that right now. Trash test number two. A stone smasher. And number three. A royal guard shield. Don't mind if I do. Arrows, bananas, apples. More arrows and some meat. Also have some stamella shrooms. Apple, apple. And a sizzle fin trout. Booster resistance to the cold. Okay. That's what I thought that was going to do. So the flame spear. That will allow us to keep our attack up stuff. 13th floor. Two frost pellets, a large ice choo-choo, two blue bokoblins, bokoblins, and a black bokoblin. First pibble. Throws nobody. All right. And your shield. That was a black one. take those results. I mean, actually, just standing next to it will help to remove the ice. And there is our treasure chest. This treasure chest is going to have for us five bomb arrows. And there goes the last of it. Okay. Of course, we want to get the bow. Going to really quickly grab that, and then we're going to put this back on. That should do it for uh, resources. I do not need you. And there's no other treasure chest here, so away we go. For 14. 
Three blue, three blue bokoblins. A silver moblin. I'm gonna pause here. Silver moblin, ice breast lizalfos, and two large ice choo choos. We now have cover. And there goes that. Cannot see me. That's the silver one. stand here and wait even though we I mean this is the treasure chest we're gonna open this up we're gonna find ourselves three more ancient arrows Man, I wish I had our Bosa's Fury at this point. Alright, here's what we're gonna do. Alright, there's that. that and then and we'll just alternate this that's gonna do it I'm okay with this
Okay. More crates down here that have stuff. That. Ten ice arrows, ten regular arrows. I believe there's a crate up here. Yes, there is, plus an arrow that I shot from earlier. That can be 48. Whack. An endura shroom and a razor shroom. There's also a, an explode barrel. Another explode barrel. I think we're good here. To the next one. Floor number 15, Black Moblin, two bl blue bacoblins, a silver bacoblin, and a blizz robe. So the key here is dealing with the Black Moblin, which is over there. Again, I don't care. He's gone. I have no fire arrows, but I do have you. I have that blizzard rod. This blizzard rod is going to help us. Why? And go like this. I can go like that. This is going to be a better... Whack! He's gone! I can't carry any more melee weapons. We're going to fix that. That's done. This is why I told you you need to have your inventory maxed out before you got in here. Because otherwise you're making some really tough decisions. And you are possibly running out of weapons. Floor number 16, Frost Talus. But, let's be honest, this is actually going to be fairly simple. First things first. We'll get us a, a floaty floaty. Okay. Now, the, the trick to winning this battle, that right there. And why is that the trick to winning this battle? Because we have this. Let's get this guy out of here right now. Done. Done. I don't believe there's anything else on this floor. I think it's just the Talus. But that doesn't mean I'm not going to go look over here. Oh yeah, there's jack shit here. Alright. The next floor is a Lionel. A Lionel. 
there is there's two ways to do this. One will allow you to take his weapons. The other one won't. I'm going to use that way as a last resort. Oh, good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, thank God I missed that. Thank God he missed. We're going to try this. Yes, go. I'm feeling really good about this. I'm feeling really good about this. Oh my god. Sweet, sweet goods. Okay, so it's eleven thirty at night. I have to be really like quiet. But oh my god, that was amazing. Um, I just started feeling really good about this run. Like this is my best run of this to date. Holy shit, that was awesome. Okay. Let's, uh, let's unfreeze you. And there's our treasure chest. Yep. Five bomb arrows. Okay. So, we're now coming on to rest area number three. You will notice there are no fairies here. Since you have, since we have two fairies in our inventory, we'll get this treasure chest open. We're gonna find ourselves the royal bow. Royal shield. And the coupe de guas. The royal broadsword. Now. Um. What we're going to be coming into is the toughest area of this whole thing. For obvious reasons. It's the end. This is the end. Uh, iron shrooms, we'll need those. A couple stamella shrooms, really don't care.
There are, however, three hearty bass in the pond. Let me show you how we work those. And hold and cook. Perfect. Guaranteed full heal every time. Here we go. Floor number 19, six decayed guardians. one we now want to go kind of clockwise notice that that decayed guardian back there is live it sees me that's gone that should be everybody okay chest over here. Yep. Night shield. Fine. Good. No more anything here. Next floor has a guardian stalker. We go. 420. Four remain, including this one. Couple options we can do here. It's over there. Trying to save my ancient arrows. Three. That is done. Three floors remain. This is taking me an hour 16 so far. I'm hoping to cut some of the uh, extra shoot, uh, running around and searching for stuff out. Is that a horse? Yeah, those are horses. Could have used a horse. Rather not, though, because I have a motorcycle. Alright, next. 421. Guardian Skywatcher. I'll move over here. We gonna climb this thing. Don't you dare come over here. Now we have eight bomb arrows. The sky is very bright.
trying to get those knocked out. Damn it. see me can you cuz there's one small problem I'm out of arrows because I suck so we're gonna go what's in here should be five bomb arrows it's like I planned it oh there we go Still can't see me. Goodbye. Now all that's left to do is just take her down. And I think I'm just going to use these, to, uh, this thing to do it. You are. And that's the easiest way to take those guys down. There are two floors left. We're gonna do this. The idea is gonna be to sprint immediately. Run. Like hell. The Skywatcher will see us if we stay here too long. I want to go in here. Let's see, let me open it, please. I'm standing right in front of it. Another royal bow. Good. Shit. I'm spotted. I mean... You reach a leg in here, I'm gonna cut it off. We're kind of stuck here right now. Show me your eye. No! Gone. There is another treasure chest. There he is. Can I use Revali's Gale? <laughs> like right meow. Okay, we're about to, we're approaching our final floor. I feel that's worth repeating. We are approaching the final floor. Got some food. But honestly, we're prepared. I don't think we're gonna need it. I think this is going to actually happen. 
Hylian Shroom. Another Hylian Shroom. Now, full disclosure, I did use a lot of the guide's, you know, strategies, but you still have to... Alright, I didn't necessarily use a lot of the guide's strategies, but you still have to, you know, do the thing. Got that one. That is going to give us a royal shield. Another one. Alright, guys. Five ancient arrows left. I did waste one of them. I have... Two ancient arrows has someone's name on it. And that someone is that guy and that guy. Gone. I want him gone. And in all honesty, we can pick off the bokoblins like little by little. Gone. I mean, they see us, but good luck getting to me. Is it just me, or is it getting really... Is the game getting really choppy? You guys are sitting ducks, is what you are. It is unless, unless I choose to come down and do this. Open the game. Open the chest. Oh, five bomb arrows. Um, Bye. I would be more concerned if they were if they were regular if they were like if they weren't regular bokoblins. That's all they are. Now we're done. Now we're done. What? That's it. We have completed. The Trial of the Sword. Um. We've completed, I repeat, the Trial of the Sword. Are you kidding me? This is happening. Oh my god. Um, I mean, fine. I had a little help from the book, which about time it had some sort of a guide for this, but yeah. I mean, I never thought to use ancient arrows. I, I mean, I saw some other people use that on like their YouTube, on their YouTube thing. Um, but I never thought to use ancient arrows on Lionel's. I think actually what set this whole thing up was having that Lionel, that second Lionel go down like it, like it really should have. There's not one monk here, there are seven. This is the final, 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 final shrine. And there's my sword. You have done well. The depth of your heroism is beyond question. We are the ones who prepared this trial following a revelation from the goddess Hylia. Though to the one who has overcome the trial of the sword, you have proven your hand worthy of the legendary Master Sword. Now that the hero has gained the power to necessary to combat the calamity, our sacred duty has been fulfilled. Chosen hero. With the awakened Master Sword now boasting its true splendor. 
protect the kingdom of Hyrule for now and for always. This whole thing is giving me goddamn goosebumps. This is it. This is the last of the game I have not yet been able to defeat at any time. Now, it's mine. Oh my god, I fucking did it! Holy shit, I did it! Oh my god! You guys have no idea how much I've been dreading this part of the LP in terms of not Korok Seeds since I started the LP, knowing I was going to have to do it. Oh, look at that shiny object. So you have finally returned. Your mind, body, and soul are now ready to wield the Master Sword at its full potential. You never fail to impress. We have got the Master Sword full power for all eternity. The legendary sword that seals the darkness, a blade that can combat the calamity, Link's triumph over the trial of the sword has awakened its true splendor. Now that you are truly one with that sword of yours, I must say, its sacred glow suits you well. As ever, I shall watch over your journey from here. The princess. I am certain Hyrule's princess is pleased with your accomplishment as well. Guys, EX Trial of the Sword is now complete. You can do it again if you really want to. But nah. I'm good. Uh, we're going to turn that off uh, for all to see. Um, God, that is shiny. We got our Master Sword back at a full 60. And I say next time on Let's Play Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, we're going to give this guy what he wants. The chance that we've... The opportunity that we've played with all 900 of his little shit children of the forest by getting the last 50. And then we just got to end this thing. We'll see you guys then.